Okay, uh, it looks like you haven't fully comprehended what I told you in my video. So let's just try this again, okay? Um, and I'm going to give you a very simple example to start the day with, yeah? I, I'm pretty certain you might know Keith Lee, okay? Keith Lee is a food critic from America. He reviews all types of um, foods, okay? From all types of, from all angles of the world, okay? However, he has a shellfish allergy, okay? So Keith Lee doesn't visit restaurants where, you know, they offer shellfish because cross-contamination con could be deadly for him, okay? So he avoids these places. He's not the target audience, okay? Because himself and his given conditions. You get the point? Now imagine Keith Lee would go uh, to a restaurant somewhere along the beach, they are specialized in seafood, okay? Shellfish, homa, whatever. You think about it, they have it. They offer it. This is their specialty. They are known beyond state borders for their amazing seafood. Then Keith Lee will go there. He will look at the menu. He will not see shit there to eat because he has a shellfish allergy, right? So he will leave the place. He will start sitting down on his 16 point something million. I don't know exactly how many followers he has. And he will start ranting and venting and... Uh, whining and dining and crying about this, crying about this restaurant, how he was not able to eat anything. Okay. He, he didn't, you know, imagine that these people, a seafood restaurant, they didn't have anything I can eat. People will ask him if he's insane. So respectfully, are you insane? I'm just asking, fact checking. Okay. Because that you review makeup doesn't mean you should go where you are not the target audience. I don't know which part of that you did not un understand or maybe you missed out on it. You and moi, we are not the target audience, okay? And what you're doing is giving white woman. Just saying, you know, because historically, we've always been the standard. We've always been included. We've always been falsely painted as the standard. Everything in the world has always been about us. The beauty standard, the model industry, advertisement in the media, um, magazines, general runway models, uh, hair care products. Everything has always been as white as the standard. So lo and behold, there's a brand that targets to mainly non-white people. A white woman will go there and then tell me, oh, I review foundation. So fucking what? So fucking what, Tyler? Hmm? Because you review foundation, you feel entitled to everybody's space? Sounds about right to me. Especially with all this yapping yapping you did here. Uh, that doesn't mean I think my struggles are worse than or even compared to blah, blah, blah. Nobody cares. Nobody gives a fuck. Not that you, f you review foundations nor anything else. I'm sure you have your following, you have your target audience, just like... Not everybody is your target, your target audience, because clearly you don't make content for black people. And that's perfectly fine. Have you ever seen black people in your comments complaining that you don't try black foundations? You don't, because they are smart enough to know that they are not your target audience. However, they are male kind of skin toned uh, white people. They are in your comments. They are like, oh, I'm lighter than you. So this could work for me. I'm a little bit darker than you. So this could work for me. They are your target audience. Demand, you know, offer, demand, you get the point. However, what you did was simply wrong. And that you hear my comments now telling me that you review foundations doesn't take away from that because you can review every other brand but the one that doesn't, that doesn't cater to our skin types or skin tones. It's really not that hard. It will be the same thing than you going to, uh, I don't know, Aunt Jackie's and putting a setting mousse for braids on your hair after putting a sleek bun and then complaining that the hair is dry, is cracky, is flaky when your hair is not the target audience. It's really, really not that hard to comprehend, Tyler. If you would leave your whiteness aside for a second, probably you will be able to see that there is a world beyond whiteness, you know? So long story short, just because you review foundations doesn't give you access to every foundation on the market and doesn't give you entitlement to every foundation on the market, you know? Because had it been you were like, okay, disclaimer guys, I know this brand doesn't 
is, is I'm not the target audience. I just want to know the quality of the product, the coverage of the product. I want to know how the cover the product works on skin. Maybe that is dry, maybe that's oily, maybe that's combination skin, etc. etc. No, 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 no. Tyler started her video by telling the whole white world how a brand that does not intend to cater to white people doesn't cater to her. Okay. We got it, Karen. <laughs>